Sure to be safe. Always wear safety glasses and keep your work area well lit and tidy. Never handle or touch a pump when it's plugged in with wet hands or on a damp surface. Our 4-inch submersible pump was designed to pump water from a home water well at a range of 10 to 20 gallons per minute. This is an average sized home's typical use of water per minute. Large homes may require a larger pump. You should know that installing a pump like this takes some skill, expertise, and time. You'll also likely need some helping hands to get the job done right. It's not a one-man job and it's not a quick one, so plan accordingly. To get started, you'll need to select either a two-wire pump or a three-wire. Two-wire pumps have two conducting wires plus a green grounding wire. Three-wire pumps have three conducting wires plus a green grounding wire. Three-wire applications will also have a motor control box, typically mounted near the water tank. If this is confusing, consult a licensed electrician. To begin installation, disconnect power to the existing control box and pump. Begin by creating your splices between your wire runs and the leads on the motor. Stagger your splices so they're at different lengths and ensure you use the proper gauge wire for the length of your run. When you've properly completed your splices, reconnect power and test the pump momentarily. Testing it now is a lot easier than when it's installed deep in the well. After you've properly wired and tested the pump, it's time to make your connections to the discharge outlet and prepare to lower the pump into the well. Use a polyethylene pipe that's rated for the correct PSI for your installation, which will depend on the depth. Thread the first length of discharge pipe. At this time, also connect a safety rope to the eyelet on the pump discharge and tie it off securely to something above ground that won't move. You don't want to lose the pump into the well. You also might consider a pipe elevator to help with the pipe lowering, as the process can get very heavy very quickly. Lower your pump and drop pipe into the well, securing your wiring with electrical tape to the drop pipe every 3 to 10 feet. Once you've completed the drop, you can make your final connections, including the check valve and well seal. Connect your wiring into the control box for three wire applications or directly to the electrical disconnect box. Once your plumbing is completed inside the home to your pump, you're ready for service. This is a big job, so if you have any issues or questions, refer to your owner's manual for more detailed help.